He spoke about that attempted assassination. He spoke about taking a bullet for democracy and also saying that he only stood before the crowd by the grace of God. He said that he would fight, fight, fight and win, win, win in November. He talked about the problems besetting the Democratic Party. Uh, he joked about that, saying the Democrats don't even know who their candidate is for November's election. And he held a poll asking the crowd who they would rather see him go up against Joe Biden or Kamala Harris. And of course, it was the first time that he appeared on stage with his presidential, vice presidential pick, J.D. Vance. It was a moment to see them together, but also to hear from J.D. Vance. He spoke about what he called some of the biggest mistakes the U.S. has ever made, and he referenced what he called the sweetheart deal that was given to China when they were allowed to join the World Trade Organization, signaling that if we see a Trump-Vance administration next year, they are likely to continue that America first agenda, very much pushing nationalism and isolationism and the chance of some stronger tariffs, something that Donald Trump has been suggesting that he would put in place if he's president again.